I thought why not to film a makeup video on my iPhone today so I decided to throw it on maybe I'll make it as a separate video maybe it will be just included into my vlogs so I'll be using this uh, BB the skin beautifier for my foundation it's from, from L'Oreal I've been really loving it since um, since forever it's green and once it's been blended i'll usually use my hands to blend it out so once it's done it's getting like the this kind of color which is tan more of it that's really good it's really hydrating and also it will reduce the redness crease skin i really did my hair see like a super light waves and now i'm gonna be applying this foundation see the skin is getting very smooth and light <laughs> it's very this guy's a super loud oh my god you guys i worked out so well but it was so intense on my arms so i can't just feel them they're super super intense and i can't lift them every movement just gives me this kind of pain so i applied that foundation and we'll be just doing this very basic and very minimal makeup that i usually wear those are like a natural makeup that i usually go for and uh later on once i'm done with my foundation i usually use the um, bare minerals um powder sorry guys it's a little bit dirty so we'll be using that today as well so we'll just dip my brush into um, and you know guys I'm not the makeup artist or something but every one of I'm pretty sure that you also do your makeup so I'm just showing you the way that I do my makeup and maybe it will be interesting and maybe you'll find some products you'll discover something that i do it will be helpful for you if you have some tips for me then i'll be happy to hear those as well uh, yeah i usually do natural makeup for every single day it's so hot today guys it's like crazy it's the second day already it's super super hot then i'm gonna take and do my my favorite palette it's uh, ridiculously old old but really amazing because this is one of my favorite this is kat von d palette and i already used all of them except this one the darkest shade but of course definitely my favorite one was the shade in the middle i think it had that uh you know the grayish kind of um, undertone which is really amazing for my type of skin so that when you do contouring it's really amazing when you have this grayish undertone in the contouring um, kit whatever you have because it gives this natural shade I hate those you know the brownish ones that they give you like the yellowish kind of undertone to your skin so I don't really use it and all shades from this palette from Kaplan D. Maybe you know this, but this is how it looks. It's very, very old. I think now it's a little bit updated, but it's good. It's amazing. They give this uh, grayish undertone to the skin and also to the mm, when you contour your face. It's just so good. So I usually like applying under my chin, uh, on my under my cheekbones, everywhere. And for my nose, I don't go like, you know, like for super deep contouring, I usually go like this. Just like with a huge brush, like it's done. And now I'm going to take the NARS Orgasm. The name is amazing. So I'm gonna go with these three shades together. So I'm gonna blend them all in one. Where's my brush? I'm gonna use this kind of brush, like the very, I don't know how you call it guys. You know better. If you know, let me know. It's like this. So I'm gonna just mix them all together like this because they're all amazing. They kind of give this very shimmery uh, look to the cheeks and I kind of like it now. It's getting closer to summer so I want a little bit of the shine to my own face. Um, and uh, I like doing this thing. Look at the sun, it's coming. 
I'm entertaining everybody. I don't mind. Chain on my forehead and a little bit on the nose. Also, I'm gonna dip it and just do it like this. On my eyes, where you have this like the very um, deepest thing on your eye. So I'm gonna just like apply and do it like this. Very light motion. And uh, yeah. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to get you guys and makeup artists they may be surprised at what I'm doing here but that's what I do and everybody's different it's just they do what they like and it's beautiful yeah see those guys are just going five times back and forth and so loud all right so I did into my contour and I'm gonna just be applying with this fluffy brush with the to create that very very natural kind of um, shade so like a feel with makeup no makeup uh, I think the Sun is going really crazy on me and now I'm gonna go with the smaller brush of course like this the flat one and I'm gonna dip it to the same contour yeah this kind of makeup you can create even with the I think three products you only need a uh, foundation, uh, some sort of uh, contouring palette, really good one, and uh, blush, some mascara to apply on. Oh, if I want to make it a little bit deeper, my eye and my uh, look, then I'll go and dip this flat brush a little bit into the contour again, and then just go from the outer corner, just like, tap it, tap it like this nothing extra it's like very very beginners that's what i do i feel like the makeup with no effort is the miracle if you put no effort into something which looks normal which looks um natural then this is the best thing ever so i'm gonna dip it like this again one more time just to create the deeper kind of look effect on my eye like this like this and then I'm gonna put apply a little bit under my lip I have very thin lips so I um, like just to a little bit apply and if I apply too much then I get rid of it with my finger that's basically it I think I like it this way yeah why not if I want to create a little bit oh my god my arm is shaking my everything is shaking it's just like so crazy you guys Oh no, I think tomorrow I won't be even able to lift a cup of coffee or something, even the spoon I think. I'm happy with what I have now, I'm going to apply the, um, I think I'm going to go straight with my uh, eyeshadow, no, I think let's do eyebrows, let's do eyebrows. So I'm going to first, I'm going to brush them really quick just like with my regular brush that I have on the tip of my uh, pen pencil is a pen or pencil pencil now I want super super natural eyebrows I don't like the crazy ones again so to create the super natural eyebrows I'm gonna be using my favorite brow uh, defin defining kit from BH cosmetics and they have it like this shade in the middle I'm gonna go for mm, yeah with my lip pen definitely with the angled brush I'm gonna dip it in the shade in the middle and just <laughs> I hope you guys like it. I hope I really like this makeup. It's just so easy, very uh, natural, and you can go anywhere like this. You can even go, you can even add a red lipstick and a little bit more of the depth to your eye with a little bit more shade and go for the evening, uh, for the date, for to the club. Yeah, with this self-isolation thing has been so so crazy um, it's been already a month I think over a month that being we've been self-isolated and uh, we just sit at home we I mean for me it's not a big difference I film my videos I post pictures I 
post pictures that I take at home, which is really amazing, kind of explore this kind of situation. And I usually, um, and I edit new kind of mm, section to my pictures. I mean, not the section, but new kind of vibe to my, my Instagram because I added those um, more of a picture of the day or the outfit outfit of the day kind of style where I take a picture like a selfie picture in front of the mirror with whatever I'm wearing today and I think it's been kind of cool and I'm really enjoying that so my regular workout routine changed of course because I have to do everything at home and I have to go for some maybe some workouts uh, sessions for like a take it from the youtube and stuff some of those i create myself and it's been it's been interesting too i moved myself because the sun is ridiculous and i just i think it's a little bit better okay so now i'll be applying my mascara on my eyelashes and we'll be doing it this way so when i apply mascara i try to lift them as much as possible i do not use those beautiful friends i just try to lift them as much as i can and kind of curl them towards myself yeah that's this is the, the light is not the best definitely but let me know in the comments what you think about these kind of videos if you enjoy it or it's not worth it it's not worth the time and effort to film those you know in the very very beginning of my youtube channel i was doing the makeup videos the makeup videos they didn't go really well on my channel so i decided to stop filming them because they took too much time to edit and they took too much time and effort just to film them uh, because you have to be i was trying to be professional and i was doing those close-ups you know like with the eye to Ooh, what's that with an eye to my like camera and stuff but then I, I thought and also I put a bunch of uh, products in there under you know the links of the products that I was using and even re the replacement sometimes but then later on I thought you know what I'm not gonna film those because they're not like very going really well and people are not even um, know knowing about my existence, about my presence on the YouTube so I'm gonna choose a different kind of niche and start for and go for it so and then I decided to film those videos for like a fashion kind of stuff where I talk about fashion where I do more of a fashion things and today I decided to maybe to throw some makeup video but not in a complicated format but more of a like a chat format and uh, that's what I'm doing right now you girl I'm applying the mascara on my lower eyelashes and I got this beautiful friend right here it's crazy the pimple is crazy i hate pimples oh i love pimples Ooh. i don't know any person who would say that maybe you guys know Ooh, look at that pimple it's just grew on my face Ooh, it's so pretty oh my goodness i love it i love you i love you people i'm not gonna get rid of you yeah just love and being silly what else to do during the self-isolation thing you know guys i think that the world itself is not gonna get better anytime soon uh i mean <laughs> i'm not being like a super pessimistic or something i meant to say that it's not gonna be the same it will be different it will be completely different after the uh covid19 it will be all this social distancing thing even yesterday we went to uh shopping and i mean to to pick up those, those groceries and uh also to a couple stores the people are just scared afraid to even smile to each other because they think that if you smile to someone then it will maybe that person will decide to to talk to you and you don't want to because it's you, you're so afraid to get sick and uh, you just like so scared that this person will talk to you and you you not you you not be comfortable to say no don't talk to me and just like staying like this and just looking at the floor and they look oh my goodness I'm just busy with my phone yeah 
it's 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 crazy a little bit and i'm not sure when and if it's gonna be the same if we go i mean if it goes back to the situation where people just talk to each other so nicely and outside so now since i applied a lot like ton of mascara to my eyelashes so i'm gonna come close i'm gonna I'm gonna come closer so you guys can see how much mascara I applied already. I'm going to curl them like this and just hold a little bit. Just holding like this. And I will be applying more on the tip of my outer corner of my eye. And once I'm happy with the result, I'm gonna go and uh, do my lips. And recently I've been loving uh, natural lips, so I'll be using this L'Oreal uh, lipstick in 9, 978. Mm, I love that picture. Oh yeah. So, and this is the color of the lipstick. Oh, why is that? Ooh, it's broken you guys who broke my lipstick i like break my lipsticks sometimes i mean not in purpose but it happens i like the very natural to create the very natural shade mm, tips from masha you know so to create the very natural shade i like just tapping it in this kind of motion <laughs> um in a very interesting situation right now and then the lower one and the shade of this lipstick is very good it's like nude but with the a grayish more of it on the uh, cooler undertone I hate when my tooth is like this I just every time I see it it's getting me really really uh, angry once I applied it on my lips in a tapping motion so in this case the lips uh, will look natural and it will not look like you put tons of lipstick on your lips and you created this like a whole bunch of uh, color and whole bunch of layers but when you tap it creates a natural shade and natural color then I'm gonna take the um, pencil from L'Oreal it's for eyebrows actually but I really like using it for my lips because of the shade the shade is so perfect I'm gonna go and just highlight a little bit uh, to make the lips more defined and I like doing that right after I put my lipstick on because it's better because you already have this some sort of shape and you can just highlight it or eyeline no or line it yeah just do it take your finger any finger you like and you just tap it like this in this motion to smooth the line and to make it natural that's it that's all see Ooh, and the sun is shining on me and i'm feeling so so good and look at those waves oh my god the makeup i usually go for my everyday makeup see it's so natural it's so nice maybe uh i have some imperfections right here on my face but it happens usually and see i really like it that it's really natural it goes just like this i like taking pictures like this i like uh filming the videos like this maybe for videos i usually add a little bit more on my outer corner to create the depth of, of the eye because when you film a video it's just to kind of saturate your look a little bit so you have to be brighter than you normally are but for every day, I usually go for this kind of makeup where I only use highlights, uh, like contour on my eyes, then a little bit of eyebrows, a little bit of lips, a little bit of my eye lashes, and that's all. 
yeah let me know in the comments if you enjoy this video and what makeup you guys go for uh, i'll be waiting for your feedback definitely and i love you guys so so much and i'll see you in my next next video bye